in by doing my brows. I'm gonna use the Becca Cosmetics Poreless Matteless Poreless Primer for my brows, and then I'm gonna go in with this eyebrow pencil that I got from Ulta Beauty, and I'm gonna apply that to my brows as well. Then I'm gonna go in with LA Girl Pro Conceal in the color Toffee and I'm gonna clean up the front of my brows as well as the top of my brows. that I'm still gonna go in with the LA Pro Girl Pro Conceal and Toffee and I'm gonna prime my lids and I'm going to blend that out because the look we're going for today is gonna be brown just nothing but brown like different shades of brown brown with a I don't want to say halo but it's just something I came with with I thought it was cute and then I'm gonna go in with the Nubian palette from Juvia's Place and I'm gonna take that dark brown shade and I'm gonna pack it in my crease and then after I do that I'm gonna blend it out and then you know just a little something something Then after that, I'm going back in the Nubian palette and I'm going to take the other brown shade and I'm going to put that, you know, as my transition as well as to kind of fade those edges out so the edges don't be as harsh. And then I'm going to go in with that Norris Radiant Concealer and I'm going to use that to cut my crease. I cut my crease I'm gonna use this brown shade right here in the Nubian palette and I'm gonna pack that at the in outer corner of my eye but I changed my mind and I decided to use like the dark color that I cut my crease with and then I'm gonna go back in with that brown shade and I'm gonna use that as the it's not the outer corner but it's still on the outer corner of my eye
Then I'm going to go back in the Nubian palette and I'm going to use that brown shade right there. And I'm going to pat that alongside this color brown, that other last color brown that we just laid down. And I'm going in at an angle so we can give, give it a more defined look. that I'm gonna go in with the last shade and I'm gonna put that in the inner corner of my eye and I'm gonna just blend out that edge to the other edge of the last brown that I put placed down told you it's a lot of brown and I'm gonna just pat that in and just blend it out so no harsh lines radiant concealer and I'm gonna wing it out and then after I get the shape that I want then I'm gonna go in in the Juvia's Place Nubian 3 coral palette and I'm gonna set use the lighter shade in this palette and I'm gonna go over on top of the wing liner that I just did After that, I'm going to take that Radiant NARS Concealer and I'm going to go in my crease and I'm going to create like a round kind of shape, kind of like something like to frame it out. And I wanted it kind of thick, so that's why it's, you know, made in that shape. And so, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. With that same Juvia's Place Nubian 3 Coral Palette, I'm going to take this same shade and I'm going to pack it in my crease. And then I'm going to kind of tighten up some of the edges and add some more color that was kind of washed out while creating that cut crease thingy effect. <laughs> Then after that, I'm going to go in with the Maybelline Great Lash um, Mascara and I'm going to put some on my lashes and I'm going to pop my lashes on and then I'm going to go in with a Becca um, Backlight Primer, primer and I'm going to put that all over my face and I had forgot to clean up, you know, my mistake area where my shadows are. So I'm going to clean that up real quick. You see? You see? See? See?
after I get to cleaning that up, I'm gonna use the Urban Decay Naked Foundation and I'm gonna put apply that all over my face and with a brush. And then after that, I'm gonna go in with a beauty sponge from Real Techniques and I'm gonna take some of the excess product off my face so it doesn't look cakey. Then after that, I'm gonna go in with the LA Girl um, Pro Concealer and Toffee, and I'm gonna highlight up under my eyes, the bridge of my nose, my chin, and my forehead. After that, I'm going in with the black opal walnut foundation stick and I'm going to contour my face. Then after that, I'm gonna go in with the shop Sasha Buttercup on um, cosmetic setting powder, and I'm gonna set up under my eye, and it's in the shape um Buttercup. After that, I'm going to use the Makeup Revolution Glow Contour. I'm in Bronzer Compact, and I'm going to put a place that everywhere I put my contour.
I rubbed that in on my nose, these girls start feeling this stuff, even though they bright light. <laughs> and then after that, I'm gonna use the Max Studio Pro um, press powder in deep, and I'm gonna apply that everywhere that I didn't put my highlight or contour. After that, I'm going to use that same color that I put in my crease. Um, I'm going to put that up under my eyes to kind of, you know, smoke it out a little bit. And then I'm going after that, I'm going to use the e.l.f. Um, eye cold pencil in black. And I'm going to put that up under my eye and I'm kind of smudge that out a little bit as well. After I apply my mascara to my lower lash line, I'm going to go back in with that Juvia Place palette. And I'm going to take the shimmery shade and I'm going to put that in my inner corner of my eyes. And after that, I'm going to take this Black Radiance blush in the color Warm Berry and I'm going to apply that to my cheeks. And after that, I'm gonna go in with the Wet n Wild um, Glow um, highlighter, and it's in the shade Hustle and Glow. I'm gonna put that to the highest points of my cheeks, down the bridge of my, and down the bridge of my nose. And then after I apply that, then I'm gonna go in with the Black Radiance. Um, it's a baked bronzer. But to me, it's gonna work as a highlight because it is too light and too shimmery to be a bronzer for me. So I'm gonna apply that everywhere that I apply. See, everywhere that I apply the Wet n Wild Hustle and Glow. Then after that, I'm gonna set my face with the Urban uh, Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. And then I'm gonna use this Wet n Wild Eye Cold Pencil in Brown. I just used this one for my lips, y'all. And I'm gonna line my lips with that. And then I'm gonna go in, after I line my lips, I'm gonna go in with the LA Girl um, Matte Lipstick. And I'm gonna apply that in the center of my, li my lips, my lid, my lips. And then after I do that, then I'm going to go over it with some lip gloss from, I just got it from Dollar General. I don't know the name of it. <laughs> That's the final look, y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Like, 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 and comment, please, please. 
and don't forget to share as well and let everybody know what's know and see what your girl is doing on her channel all right y'all take it easy be blessed bye bye